New here tonight, Hillsborough County school leaders are providing an update on how tax dollars are being used. They are also sharing the district's spending plan on referendum projects. ABC Action News reporter Mary O'Connell shows us how the district leaders say the funds will make a difference in your child's education. Hillsborough County voters approved an education referendum in 2018. And as of this month, Hillsborough County Public Schools says they've invested more than $246 million into their schools. This project will allow us over a 10-year referendum to be able to uh, create 1,700 plus new initiatives and projects in our schools to be able to create a competitive, uh, modernized uh, element where our children have a sense of pride every single day. The district says 80% of projects have been awarded to local businesses and 25% awarded to small and minority-owned businesses. Over the 10-year referendum, the district plans to overhaul more than 200 AC units, more than 60 roofs, and plans to spend $23 million on safety and security and $25 million on technology upgrades. I asked the super Superintendent, if projects like this would be possible without the referendum dollars? Hopefully the answer is no. I mean, we have replaced so many ACs, roofing, added new flooring, really updated our facilities. There's just no way. 14 major projects are planned this summer. School district leaders want you to know you can trust them with every dollar and every cent that's invested. We want the community to feel that the money that they're extended to public education and for this particular project as identified on the ballot is genuinely being used in a manner in which it should be used. And it's for our children, so it's always a win. In Tampa, Mary O'Connell, ABC Action News.